initiating countdown. Q minus seven, six, five, four. Popcorn, popcorn, ocelots, popcorn. Three, two, one, commence television! Look at the lights! The Incredibly Bold Adventures of Laser Squid and Sidekick Sammy! Episode 22! Behold! My most recentest invention! The Chrono Manipulatortron! The... Huh? It's like a remote, but for real life. You can actually pause, fast forward, and rewind life itself. Dad, our show's on. Vincent, you spent 3.4 quarks too much time in front of the TV. Why, when I was your age, I was always studying something, inventing something, particularly accelerating something. Dad. Bra. Professor. Oh, rightio. Next week, same squid time, same squid channel. A week? That's like a whole month away. If only there was some way to zip through the week and get to next week's show faster. Whoa! Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Uh-huh. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Possibly not. Shouldn't we ask permission first? Yeah, I'm not sure Dad would like us using his chrono manipulatortron just to watch TV. Relax, V Monster. Everyone knows if you borrow something for under five seconds, you don't need to ask permission. Um. Okay. Got it. <gasps> Pause. Ah. Dad? Prof Q? Yo, Professor! <gasps> it works! It's chronotastic! I'm fabulous! Life, I'm just too perfect! I'd better unpause him. Not unpause him. Rewind him! <laughs> <laughs> Time to fast forward to next week. <laughs> the incredibly bold adventures of Laser Squid and Sidekick Sammy, episode 23. Continued next week, same squid time, same squid channel. <laughs> Laser Squid and Sidekick Sammy, episode 24. Same squid time, same squid channel. Laser Squid and Sidekick Sammy, episode 25. was episode 10 million, the final ever episode of Laser Squid. Beauty wonder touching for... <laughs> Just how far forward did we fast forward? Um, I think we may have got a little carried away. We better get back to where we started. Rewind. So I guess we should return the Chrono Manipulatortron now. Vincent Q, you're late, dig? Ah, Vincent, right on time. Here. 
And now, quadruple double physico biology in the key of cool. <laughs> And that's why a ninja can never outrun a black hole. Lesson over, you dig? It only took three seconds, but I feel four hours smarter. Way to go, Vinny. Kick and cue. Speedy. Yeah? Sweet remote, Vinny. I think we'll steal it. No, you won't. Rocket, chrono manipulator trying to fight them. Are you guys thinking what I'm thinking? Oh, yeah! This time for sure! <laughs> or not. <laughs> On three. One, two, three! and Q. You and your talking toolbox are always racing around with no regard for more important people. You should be banned. Mm, I wonder what the eject button does. Um, we should probably go. Go have more chrono manipulated drum fun! Rocket, no! <laughs> the Chrono Manipulator Tron! It's Chrono Manipulator Bastard! I wonder how far back we went! B Man, check it out! The past is exactly the same! Not exactly the same. Hi, Cabin Boyo Cheese! Hi, Cowherd Organic Wheat! Hi, I'm um, Silent But Lethal Ninja! Wow! Who's that? He's the coolest! VP Stern? And who's that fine fuselage foxulous fan? Ducky! <laughs> I think I want to go home now. We're not going anywhere. You mean we're stuck in the past forever? Never fear, V-Man, for there is a man who can fix this. A man of intelligence, of genius, of learning, of science. A man called Professor Quigley Q. Dad, I mean Prof Q. I mean Quigley. The Astounding Leisure June Adventures of Hypno Rabbit. Dad? Prof Q? Professor? Uh, we were kind of hoping you could fix this. <laughs> uh, Dad? V mm. Man, your dad's a TV tube head hypno cow. He doesn't even know what a chrono manipulatron is. Behind that vacant stare thinks the brain of a genius. Dad's always trying to inspire me. We gotta do the same for him. We've got to inspire him to invention. We've got to wise him to science. We've got to prop him up. Rocket, get rid of that TV. <laughs> Guys, let's go to work. <laughs> Fascinating. A chrono manipulatron. Simply genius. <laughs> All fixed now. Woohoo! We did it! We turned my dad from a garden slug brain into a genius. And he fixed the remote. Thanks, Dad. I mean, Quigley. 
No, thank you, Vincent. You've opened my eyes to science, my ears to physics, and my nose to astrobiology. Maybe you'll do the same for me one day. See you later, Prof. Way later. Vincent, ingenious timing. Your 1.2 newtons per second favorite show is on... The Incredibly Bold Adventures of Laser Squid and Sidekick Sammy, episode 22. Seen it. Boring. No thanks. The Astoundingly Jejun Adventures of Hypno Rabbit. <laughs> <laughs> 